So, Ishita, tell me something about you in brief. Uh, what Ishita is all about? Yes, sir. Good afternoon. Uh, thank you for allowing me to introduce myself. My name is Ishita Chaubisa. Uh, I am born and brought up in Dungapur, Rajasthan. But past three years, I am living in Udaipur. I am currently a third year, uh, third year computer science engineering student in Gitanjali Institute of Technical Studies. My aggregate percentage in uh, BTEC is 85.55%. Now moving towards my technical skills, I have done uh, programming in C, C++ and Python. And project, project related to this skills are speed typing test in Python and library management uh, using C++. Uh, now, I have also basic knowledge of web development like HTML, CSS, JavaScript, uh, frameworks like Bootstrap and Tailwind. And the project related to this skills are uh, Teen Dog app and uh, Dice Game. And in backend, I have uh, familiar with the concepts of Firebase. And I have also explored myself in the area of IoT where I have uh, done a project which got selected in internal SIH uh, named after smart control unit, uh, where I have designed the UI of the app and uh, worked on the Things Big uh, Cloud Server and also did the uh, integrated programming of hardware and software. And now moving towards my technical uh, extracurricular activities, I have found of reading writing and I, I play uh, TT in my spare time where I secured third position in Gates Sports. And that's all about me. Thank you. Okay, nice intro. So give me more understanding about IoT because you have done projects in IoT and you have participated in SPAR India Hackathon also. Yes, sir. Uh, our team got selected in SIH, uh, internal SIH, sorry. Um, so we had made a smart control unit which will uh, monitor uh, the temperature, humidity and uh, uh, real-time location of the product uh, which will uh, also tell about the gas composition uh, and all the data will be stored in the uh, SD card and will notify the authority or organization which, uh, which is uh, just uh, asking for the cold supply chain. Basically, this project is all about the cold supply chain, which will monitor the temperature, humidity, and uh, uh, real-time location of the uh, products. No, I just wanted to know that, give me more understanding about IoT. Sir, IoT is basically about the automation. It's like uh, connecting hardware to software to automate the things. Okay, In what is the relation between... Artificial intelligence and IoT, they both are related or there is no relation at all? Uh, sir, according to me, uh, they are like related because artificial intelligence is also about the automation. Like machine learning is also part of that, which also count in automation. So in your opinion, uh, all are interrelated, right? Uh, yes, sir. So, so your hobbies are reading, writing. And what else? Uh, so playing table tennis. Playing table tennis. So do you know anyone in table tennis who is a, the international player from India? Um, no, sir. I'm not you that have the you have told. And what kind of books you read? Sir, like different, different genre, like self-help books. Uh, Technical book or books. the common common books you are talking uh, about? Common books are more like novels. Novels, okay. What is the difference between novels and drama? Okay, sir. Sir, drama drama is more based on fiction. Novels can be based on reality also. Drama cannot be based on reality. So can be. It can be. Then it will not be the perfect definitions. Yes, sir. Okay. Which field do you want to go? What is your interest area? So I want to go in the software development part. Software development part. It means the front end as well as back end both. Yes, sir, in both. Okay. 
So where there is a more creativity and innovations required in front end or in in back end? Sir, back end required logic, logic thing, logical thinking. Uh, okay. Front end based front end. on more on designing part. Front end is more on packaging, nothing more than that. No, sir. Uh, back end requires more logical thinking. And the front end required what? Ah, uh, sir. It ah uh, it more based on ah uh, designing part. Like no, how sir. our interface will gonna look like. Okay. Do you have an idea that which is which one is the best website? Uh, whom we can say that is the best website which we have made or it is being made in India. In India. Yeah. I'm talking about Indian websites. In your Indian opinion, or you have heard about any kind of the best websites? No, no, sir. I have no. Not any any guesses. It's a it's a random question. There is no answer also. But I just wanted to know. Might be as a computer science graduate, you might be knowing it that uh, whom we can say is the best website. Or there is no any kind of best websites. Every website has their different features. Obviously, sir. But uh, I think Gigs for Gigs is like more uh, is best website in learning and for CPU. Gigs for Gigs. Gigs for Gigs. Yeah. Why? Why it is best, sir? It, it gives good knowledge and quick knowledge about the things you wanted to learn. Okay. Okay, Ishita. Nice talking to you. Right, Ishita. So I heard you say that you want to become a software developer, right? Yes, sir. Okay. So tell me, why should a company hire you as a software developer? so i should be hired uh, for this role because uh, for my relevant skills positive attitude uh, work ethics and uh, my passion for doing work and if a company will hire me then i'll assure uh, assure them to add an asset to their company so what are the relevant skills you have so relevant skills related to their work profile like if they want um developing skills uh, like programming skills so i'll work upon that more harder so that i can fit into their work profile so what are the skills required for a software developer uh a skill required like logical and critical thinking mm. uh more on uh uh the logic building should be uh, good hmm and uh, their uh, under uh, their understanding should be uh, their understanding should be very uh, very fast and and uh, precise hmm so i think okay so if a person is good in logical build logical uh, can build things logically and uh, but doesn't know the programming language he still can become a software developer no sir uh, there should be a balance between both the things so, like, so you did mention that language is programming language is not is necessary isn't that a relevant skill uh, so it is okay so what made you forget uh, the most important skill for a software developer so it just slipped from it my mind yes, right. so what programming languages you know so um, c uh, c++ python currently we are having training of python so i'm working on that so have you done any work in uh, as a software developer have you developed any software uh sir i have uh, made a little project like a uh, speed typing test so is that a software uh, yes or no no so kind of kind of meaning what kind of means what either a thing is a software or it is not a software it is sir it is 
So what 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 is the first step that you need to take in developing a software? First, uh, so capability of learning, uh, learning, and eagerness of learning things. That is the first step in developing the software. Yes, sir. If you are not able to understand what uh, language is all about, then you can't able to develop the software. So, so first I'm you a, have to I, understand I, the language. So I'm I'm your client. I have a software to develop to automate my working. So first step you will take. Sir, so I will uh, listen. Sir, I will listen to your requirement. That which kind of requirement you want, uh, then I'll work upon it. So you will listen to all my requirements and just work on it, right? Yeah, uh, no, sir. Actually, I'll listen to your requirement, and uh, if I found like we can improve here or it's not that uh, best, then I'll uh, discuss that things uh, about uh, about that project from you, and then I'll work upon it. So what will what will you do after finding the requirements? Uh, sir, after finding requirements, I'll uh, start work. Uh, start working uh, upon it. So what is the uh, waterfall model in SDLC? Waterfall model, sir. It is broadly divided into seven parts. Uh, which is uh, user requirement uh, designing. First, first no, uh, step wise. Uh, step wise. So user requirement. Okay, that the sir has asked you. Yes. Then, uh, then. Then. Uh, said uh, project description. What do you mean by project description? Uh, so like what what, uh, what kind of tech or what kind of uh, requirement user, user want? So the first one came, right? But so second, uh, like project description, like how company will gonna work upon it? So what do you call it? So I'm not getting the term. Documentation part. Documentation part. Then third. Then uh, third. Uh, designing part like uh, flow flow chart, uh, ER diagrams, DFD diagrams. Then third. Um, soft. Sorry, four, uh, soft. Four. Ah. Software specifications. What do you mean? Documentation. If that this we have to develop and this will be the minimum requirements. As per the technical manpower and as per the uh, resources required. Mm -hmm. Then third is the third is the your DLD and ER diagrams designing. Mm -hmm. Then fourth. So after um uh, designing and diagram I uh, have done. Uh, there is one thing come. Uh, will uh, check check uh, check the projects like. Uh, sorry, sir. I'll take one minute to think. Then so we'll uh, work. Uh, then we'll start doing uh, project uh, programming, and then after completing the uh, interfacing part, we'll uh, cross check with the uh, organization. fifth is designing and development, and development programming concept. Designing. Then after. So we'll uh, check for the correction. Usko term kya hai? Um, I, I honestly not remembering the terms. That's why I'm giving such an answer. You can explain like, 
it is of two types after designing we'll consult with the authority like uh, which 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 authority like uh, for which we are working for aap apni sari galti le jaake uske haath mein de doge ki humne aapke liye ye banaya aur isme ye ye bugs aur ye ye galti reh gayi nahi then so with the technical team uh, the our side we have a team tester software testing ha mm -hmm. test hai yes sir ठीक है देन लास्ट स्टेप इज सर लास्ट स्टेप इज सब बन गया गलती निकल गई गलती भी रेक्टिफाई होगी देन देन विल रीच रीच आउट टू द टू द क्लाइंट एंड and implement there and implement. there an implement on site you know yes so there are six to seven stages yes. through which a software development process goes through and in the mnc's for every process they have a specialized team power team you know for uh, contacting with the and uh, analyzing the requirements of the clients there is another team for the documentation there is another team for uh, drd this is process flow chart there is another team for programming there is another team for testing there is another team and for implementation there is another okay. team so where did you find you suitable in which team you will be more precisely can you do work um sir in designing part and you to apps in designing part or well. and programming also ठीक है सो हाउ यू विल आइडेंटिफाई है ना कि मतलब कि ईआर डायग्राम से मुझे कोड कैसे बनाना कभी किया है सर प्रैक्टिकली यू विल यू विल बी प्रोवाइडेड विद द कोड्स डिजाइन बाय द डिजाइनर ईआर डायर डीएफडी डायग्राम्स जो भी हैं अकॉर्डिंग टू दैट यू हैव टू डिजाइन द कोड यस सर किया है तक कभी नो सर नेवर डन So, sir, how will you find yourself suitable? One thing I have learned in my learning that how to search on Google. So, Google sir, so you chat GPT me kar lo. Hmm. Ah na, but see, everything, every code is available in the Google. Yes. Ah na, Google, you can tell this that it is called what is the syntax, what is the code. Who will not be able to tell you that you should use where to use it. है ना इन विच अगर आप किसी प्रॉब्लम में फंस गए मतलब इन एनी ऑफ द टेक्निकल रिक्वायरमेंट इट विल नॉट हेल्प यू दैट यूज दैट एपीआई या यूज दैट कांसेप्ट इन दैट या दिस विल बी सॉल्व फॉर दिस एक्स वाई जेड कांसेप्ट वो तो आप ही को बताना है और कैसे इंप्रूव कर पाओगे और वेयर टू यूज वेयर कांसेप्ट व्हिच कांसेप्ट आप कौन सा कांसेप्ट कहां पे यूज करना है कैसे आप यूज कर पाओगे कैसे बाय लर्निंग मोर बाय learning more on the uh, on my skills by uh, working on projects so that i can uh, identify how to work how this work will uh, code will work project or matlab uh, different types of programming problems sir in both the cases like if i am working on different kind of programming languages uh, it will increase my understanding of the code ah. Are you a regular coder on the Hacker Rank or Code Chef or anything like this platform? No, sir. So how okay. how you will just so how you will justify yourself when I have a good programmer or you can hire me on as a software developer? So for that I can. I have a problem with now. If you can solve it, it will be. Uh, suppose last we when I have a question given, I think that you have also discussed it and you can give a solution. If I have given you a string. Okay, sir. Yeah, so it is of size twenty, but it can contain any number of alphabets or characters below twenty. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So, uh, so uh, you have to identify total number of vowels in it, how much vowels there are there, uh, and uh, you have to remove all the vowels. You have to first identify all the vowels, 
and you have to accumulate all the vowels in front and the remaining characters at the last. Suppose your name is Ishita. So vowels are I, I and A. And so yes. I, I, A at, B, uh, at the initial level and T and H and T should that be last. My name is mine. It contains A, A. So A will be at the front and M, Y and K will be at the last. Okay. So, and so I... Bolna, bolna ke aise se ho Mujhe technically, bataho, loop kaan se start karoge, kaise karoge. How you will uh, arrange these al vowels and non vowels alphabets? Abhi main characters pe nahi jara. I am only working on the alphabets. Okay. Sir, I'll sort the array. Like, so, according to. Sir, if agar vowel hai, to usko apan aagi le lenge. And if vowel nahi hai. Kisi ka naam urvashi hai to. A or I. So, what is it? U, U, I. Sir, apan pointer, pointer chalayenge. If A, agar vowel aara hai. तो उसको आगे ले लो नहीं तो स्किप कर दो तो उस अकॉर्डिंग से यस कैसे लेंगे आपको स्किप नहीं करना ना बिकॉज़ एवरीथिंग विल बी रीजंबल रीजंबल तो सर पॉइंटर विल वर्क फ्रॉम द जीरो इंडेक्स तो सर अगर पॉइंटर अगर यू पे आ रहा है तो देखेगा कि ये वोवेल नहीं है तो आगे बढ़ चलो वो तो मैंने एग्जांपल दिया था आपके नाम पे आप मुझे एक्सप्लेन करो इशिता पे इशिता बस सर आई आया तो ये देखेगा वोवेल है तो ये इसको आगे रख देगा और फिर वो आगे मूव फॉरवर्ड कर देगा आगे कहां रखेगा कैसे रखेगा कुछ तो हाथ पांव के उसको देना पड़ेगा ना मैं इसलिए कह रहा हूं टेक्निकली बोलो आगे रखना पीछे रखना ऐसे तो बहुत इजी हो जाएगा बोलना सर अपन इफ लूप लगाएंगे ये क्या नया आपने आविष्कार किया इफ लूप क्या होता है सॉरी सॉरी या तो इफ होता है या तो लूप होता है सर इफ इफ अगर सर वोवेल्स है तो अपन उसको उसकी प्लेस पे रहने देंगे और इफ कॉन्सोनेंट है तो अपन उसको शिफ्ट कर देंगे पीछे तो स्पेस इशिता में फिर आई थिंक इट इज आई एस एच आई टी ए छ छ से ज्यादा की स्पेस हो जाएगी अल्फाबेट्स अगर चाहिए तो आई हैव टू स्पेस मुझे मेमोरी स्पेस चाहिए हम्म हम्म नहीं आईडिया आपको तो बस वो इसलिए टेक्निकली हम करने जाते हैं तब भी यार थोड़ा सा ऊपर नीचे हो 